Hey everybody, it's Paula here from the Excel Club and welcome to another Excel video. What we're going to look at in today's video is the use of hidden sheets and we're also going to look at the use of very hidden sheets. Now hidden sheets are a common feature but very hidden sheets are not something that everybody knows about. But before we do get stuck into this video, I hope that you will subscribe to my channel and hit that notifications button so you don't miss any more of my videos. So let's hop over now to Excel and take a quick look at hidden and very hidden sheets. So the reason people hide sheets is often to declutter a workbook. If you have a workbook that has quite a large amount of sheets, very often people will hide sheets just to declutter. Hiding sheets is also used to protect formulas and to protect inputs and data. To unhide the sheet or to remove the formulas, change the formulas, delete the formulas or the data, a user has to manually go through the process of unhiding the sheet to then make any edits to any formulas and stuff like that. So these sort of changes can't happen by accident when you are hiding sheets. But hiding sheets is by no means foolproof as it's very easy to unhide them. So let's take a quick look here. We have a sheet selected. So I've selected sheet one. Now, if I right click on that, we have the option to hide. Now that sheet is gone, but we can unhide it just as easy as we hit it by selecting on the sheet and the sheet then gets unhidden. So like I said, this can be used to declutter a workbook and for a certain amount of protection. But what a lot of people don't know about Excel is that it has this additional level of hiding that is available. And that is to make a sheet a very hidden sheet. Now I actually have two very hidden sheets here in this workbook. Now you'll notice when I go to unhide, nothing is coming up. So let's hide sheet one. Let's go to unhide. And the only option we have is to unhide sheet one. We can't unhide the very hidden sheets. It's actually not even noticeable that these very sh hidden sheets are there. So how can we unhide them? How can we even find unhidden sheets? Well, if you are using Excel Professional Plus Pro, you will have a tool called Spreadsheet Inquire. Now, Spreadsheet Inquire needs to be turned on in your add-ins, but once you turn it on, if you go to Spreadsheet Inquire and carry out a workbook analysis. So first I need to save this workbook. So I'm just going to save this workbook to my desktop. Now I can run my workbook analysis. So workbook analysis is gonna quickly run through your workbook and find a load of different things, including very hidden sheets. Now Spreadsheet Inquire will be considered a spreadsheet auditing tool and most auditing softwares will allow you to do this. So we can see here that we have two very hidden sheets and these hidden sheets are sheet four and sheet five. So from a tool like this, it's really, really easy to identify these hidden sheets. I'm just gonna close that and we're gonna go into the developer ribbon now. Now, if you don't have the developer ribbon turned on, again, you will need to turn this on. To turn it on, if you go to file, if you go to options, and if you go to customize ribbon, you need to turn on the developer into the main tabs and that will give you the developer ribbon. Then if we go to Visual Basics, what Visual Basics will do will give you this navigation and then will give you the properties. Now, if these aren't turned on, you can turn off the Project Explorer and the Properties window. So we can see them from in here. So View, Project Explorer and Properties windows. Now, when we click on a sheet, we have these properties and at the bottom, we have Visible. And in visible, we have some options. We have visible, hidden, and very hidden. If we go down to sheet four, we can see this is a very hidden sheet. And sheet five is also a very hidden sheet. Now we can quickly make these sheets visible from within here. 
But going through this and then manually changing the sheets, for locating the sheets and changing them to visible can take some time. So let's go back and make some sheets very hidden. So I'm gonna make sheet one and two very hidden sheets. And I'm gonna close my developer so we see sheets three and five are now open and others are very hidden. So if you wanted to unhide all of these at once, what can you do? Well, I went and did a search online for a little bit of VBA code. And if you hop over to the blog post, which you'll find a link below this video, you can take a copy of this code and use this code. And this code I got from another web website from ableits.com and you'll find a link in my post to directly back to that post. And that has a number of codes available, VBA codes available for hiding all very un, un, very hidden sheets at once, or for unhiding all hidden and very hidden sheets at once. So there's a couple of different codes you can use. So to insert the code, we would go again into our Visual Basics. And in our Visual Basics, we would imp insert a module. Then we can paste in our code. Now, like I said, grab a copy of this code from my website. Now, once we've pasted it in, we can actually run our code. And by running our code, if we then go back to our workbook, we can see our very hidden sheets have been unhidden, but our hidden sheet hasn't. So we can then go in and just unhide our hidden sheet. Now, like I said, there is a VBA code available to unhide all sheets, whether they're visible, um, whether they're hidden or very hidden sheets. And you'll find that on the ablebits.com blog. So that's it for today's video. Do hop over to the blog post so you can get a copy of that code and more details on hidden and very hidden sheets. Thank you very much for watching this video. I do hope that you will share it across your, your profiles and I will talk to you again soon. Goodbye now.